Hello again, everyone. We are Gaming by Gaslight. Welcome back to our RimWorld Lord of the Rims plate. Wait, what are you doing? Oh, right. I didn't actually tell anyone to... Or wait. Del Delgarandir. I did say. Everyone's supposed to be in the safe zone. What are you, what are you doing? Delgarandir. What are you doing? The seizures are coming. There you go. Silly Delgarandir. All right. Okay, so the animals are all safe. Our, uh, our warriors are... Also, in good, good standing. No, I should just have someone equipped. Who's our, uh, let's see here. I mean, Callan, well, let's see who's, who's here. So we've got Callan, Storin, Damfin, uh, Folly, I guess, is the next best. So Folly should have the, oh, and Cat comes after as far as, uh, well, they're both about the same, though. Cat actually has an interest in a passion for shooting things. Hmm. I will, uh, yeah, sort everyone back to normal there. Uh, Folly. No, not Folly. Wait. Hold on. I did this wrong. Romri, right. Romri is the person who used to have a uh, stab a majigger, but now they don't have a or shooty majigger, but they don't have one now. Right. I want him to have an actual bow. Then again, now yeah, the whole three second cooldown versus uh, versus the uh, considerably shorter cooldown of the horn bow. Yeah. So with that in mind, look back at this. I guess that means Cat should probably get a gun. All right, sir, you get a gun. Uh, equip as your sidearm. Then we can like get you to join the, the good old boys over here. Oh, wow, he actually just killed someone right off the bat. Oh, you dick. Setting my land on fire. Setting my beautiful grass on fire. Haha, <laughs> the joke's on you. You're gonna burn. You're gonna burn, son. You know, I'd really prefer if you didn't shoot over there. That'd be great. Alright, I mean, we are we are shooting them to death. Are you actually good, Gain, by the way? Oh, you are definite. You are actually, like, really, really good. You are lazy, though. But... We could have you as a backup chef. I mean, honestly, we just have, like, we have two fueled stoves. I kind of hope this gets replaced with something more thematically appropriate eventually. Not that it's terrible now. I'm just, you know, mostly complaining for the sake of complaining. But, uh, yeah. Oh, god damn it! I, I hate this. Why did I even bother building these walls? Because now all the, all these idiots do is... Do you, like, stop setting my, my land on fire, dog? That'd be great. Oh yeah, joke's on you. You set that on fire, now you're gonna burn. Willy. Oh, and now they're fleeing. Damn dirty cowards. Alright, let's, uh, might as well ch attempt to put the fire out. We'll take everyone prisoner, because why the heck not? It's what we do. Alright, unrestricted. Animals, uh, to the pasture, except of course for our sweet timber wolf. Alright, and no one even got hurt. Kind of a shame these guys didn't show up with any bows. That would be pretty sweet, actually. Uh, you know what? We'll we'll capture we'll capture everyone because we can. Actually, are, are you uh, you're dead. This guy. This is the third person. You're ugly. Yeah, that alone, and also I guess I mean vanilla gay, unless that changed, is kind of like more of a hindrance than anything. But mostly the ugly because. Ugly pawns are given the real short end of the stick here. We'll just strip your clothes off and we'll leave you for dead. Classic Rimworld. Says I. Alright, you can uh, go ahead and, yeah, st strip him and just leave him to bleed to death or get up or whatever he does. We are trying to rescue some of these people, right? 
Yeah, you know what? You guys are already here, so go ahead and just capture them. There we go. And then, you know, get back to cleaning that. You know what? That's actually a good question now that I think about it. Has the gay trait been changed? Because, I mean, what makes it a problem is the fact that pawns with the gay trait, they'll never stop hitting on people even if they've been rejected or they don't have the gay trait or at least that's how it used to be maybe they changed that which would be nice because in real life any decent human being regardless of sexuality stops hitting on someone once you know it's been made clear that you're not into them unfortunately of course regardless of gender or sexuality or anything else there's a lot of dicks out there unfortunately but uh you know we don't need them in room world i guess is where i'm going with all this we could hunt that turkey. Oh, and these guys have all just fallen asleep inside. Good for them. Anyway, and that's all I have to say about that particular matter. Also, I guess we, we might as well mine here so we can, like, you know, start walling things up. And this. And this. And even this. Actually, no, I probably shouldn't do that just yet. Because knowing me, I'll forget the, the whole, like, size thing I was trying to do. Oh, good. You guys are all taken care of. I mean, they're... They're not bad. Is what I'm thinking here. Hey, I never checked. Did they, did they lose any, like, body parts? No. Well, they didn't lose anything that they can't afford to lose. What, what were you investigating out here? What are you guys doing over here? I have no idea. Oh, they're chucking bodies. Is it- does the game seriously not consider this like the shortest path? I guess we're gonna need to build a bridge. You know, if we uh, want to encourage, like, sensible movement, in my opinion. So yeah, if we, uh, is there anything cool or new here that I haven't really noticed as of yet? The answer is no, not as of yet. Corbin Candelabra. I mean, that would be nice and fancy for here. Of course, chandeliers too. I might eventually replace the, the braziers here. Possibly, maybe. No longer an- oh, inspired surgery. Surgery's cool. Alright, let's uh... Yeah, get all this in here. I really wish replace walls worked with these Lord of the Rims, uh... Oh crap. Uh, let's see here. One... Ah, dang it. Knew I shouldn't have... Oh, wait, 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 wait. One, two, three, four, five. So one... Wait a minute. One... I designed this so it would be even with... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Then this is going to be mined out, so that'll be... You know, we'll wait until this is finished, then I'll figure out what I was doing again. Because obviously, it's pretty clear that I have forgotten exactly what it was I was attempting to do. But I do know that we wanted even, even walls here. Oh crap. That was pretty dangerous. Walls are collapsing. Actually, if I just keep... Uh, yeah, one... Five, one, two, three, four, and then five, and then one here, and one here, and then there's our double door. Excellent, it all balanced out. That's what I like to see. All right. What are we, what are we doing here? Are we mining this? We are not, that's just, oh. Wait, these are part of, yeah. All right, good. All right, it, it's, it's gonna be great. Probably. And of course we'll build a copy of this because we want our sexy oh. Oh, oh wait. Yes yeah. Did, wait, did I wanna crap, I forget what I was I was really attempting to accomplish here. Alright, I mean I guess we'll use the Elven Grand Gate. I guess. If we have to. We really still have rocks lying around here. I suppose it has something to do with all of this. And all of this. Yeah. Anyway, the important thing is that things are actually coming along pretty nice. We can, like, build a sweet-ass throne. 
There we go. Dwarven throne. Got to make it out of granite. Or maybe, you know what? Marble. Marble is fancier. And we do have the gold. Oh, crap. I did screw this up. Because this is a free by free. Damn. Damn. I ruined it all. I thought this was two by two, but it's in fact free by free. All right. Well, if I put this here, and obviously the quality's got to be like at least, at least masterwork. No, do I really want to do that? You know what? We'll leave it. We'll leave it at default for now. I mean, obviously, better would be great, but uh, hey, you know what? We actually do have a reasonable amount of stuff on us. So let's. Well, no. Let, let's let's say excellent. Make it at least excellent quality, if you can. And now we're going to have to change the shape of this room a little bit. So boop, 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 and then other boop. And we, uh, we cancel this, deconstruct this door. Right. That should, that should make this, yeah, and then we have like two by two statues on either side. And then, mmm, mmm, this is going to be great. Going to be the best. You'll, you'll have never, ooh, and we're even having a party. Nice. I like that. All right. Cool. And that's that's the cram you're eating, is it? That's got to be cram, right? Presumably. That is, in fact... Or... Eh, it is what it is. Meanwhile, we're having a cool party in here in this cool room for cool and attractive people. All right. Yeah. And I guess I can slowly kind of start mining this. Because we know that we want to put walls here. All right. This is going to be good. All right. And I'm going to build a bow for who is it again that needs their gun? It's uh, Romery. Right. All right. Good. So we've got this going. All right. So boop, boop, and boop. That's... How that's supposed to look if memory serves. One, two, three. Oh dear. How did I manage to screw this up? You know what? We'll wait until we'll wait until the walls are up and then I'll figure out how I screwed this one over. Let's see here. Hmm. I, you know what, I, I'm not quite seeing it. So I suppose, let's see, one, one, two, two. Ah, okay, now I, now I see it. Yeah, two here, so I move this over. So one, one, and then two. Okay, there we go. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. All right, so mine this, and this, and this, and this, and that, and this, and that, and so on. That, and I'm gonna just queue each of these manually for no particular reason, except because apparently that's just how I do things now. The most inefficient way possible. All right. Yeah. Ooh, we struck even more iron. My god. There is so much iron in these hills, it is ridiculous. All right, yeah, everything's gonna balance out in time, and that's the important thing. That's all I care about. As long as it eventually balances out into something that resembles a good a good thing, then I am happy. I feel like I've got to do something really special with the floor here. Like it can't just be like the regular smooth floor that we've got going with everything else. So let's think about that. Let's look at the various floors we have. I mean, not paving stone. That's not good enough. Actually, thinking here as I look at this, stone is this. This is broken asphalt. Okay, which I'm pretty sure we don't have access to in just this. Yeah, random paving stones. That would be good for roads, me thinks. So we've got our tile, flagstone, flagstone. I don't know. I don't think that's fancy enough. What do we got over here? I mean, we've got our, like, mosaic pattern here and our checkered slabs. 
I mean, we could do like mosaic. I don't know, you know, I don't, I don't, I don't know, cancel that. I'm thinking to myself, do I want like a, cons a consistent floor, perhaps? Hmm. Yeah, like, uh, I don't know, maybe marble stone slab for this, and then like here we do something fancy, like checkered. Che would checkered make the most sense? Does checkered even make any sense? Hmm. See here, limestone, marble, and granite. I mean, I'd like marble and slate, but we don't really have have any of that, do we? Hmm. Well, you know what? We'll try it. We'll try it this way first, I guess. One one side at a time. We'll we'll figure this out. All right. Oh, and then we can probably get rid of this. Actually, you know what? let maybe maybe I'll leave that for now because I'm not entirely sure if. Uh, Pretty sure that now, because this yeah, this room is basically like similar dimensions to this. This should hold up. Should hold up. Doesn't mean it will hold up. All right. Okay, now how did I uh, screw this one up? Let's have a look. What did I do wrong? Okay, so one 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 here here and here. All right. Oh wow, that was that was easy. Well, we have recruited a new man, or was it, was it a new man? Willie, you are in fact a male dwarf, and crap, I don't. Oh wait, wait, I do have it written down. I was gonna say there was at least one other name suggestion that was given to me that I have not uh, added yet. There we go. There we are, name suggestion entered. And what else do we got going on here? A lot of blood we gotta clean up still. And also some axes. Anyway, all right. Yeah, this is, it's coming together. And I like that, that's good. All right, so build a copy. I kinda want this door. Well, I guess I can't really build that there yet, can I? All right, yeah, let's uh, claim that and then reinstall it. We'll reinstall it in here for now. We'll, actually, no, don't don't even do that. Reinstall just over here, and we'll eventually figure out what we're doing with the wall lights and everything. All right, but yeah, yeah, now we've got... Uh, we are slowly building something that we will be very, very proud of, I reckon. All right. This is going to be a dwarven hall that will stand the test of time, probably, maybe. All right. We build a little bit of this over here, like that. Then, if we go back into more floors, you know what? Let's uh, let's do a mosaic paving just to, just to start. And if we don't like it, we can build something else. I mean, we've got lots and lots and lots and lots of blocks, don't we? There's a lot of stuff. Um, actually. Oh yeah, there we are. 500 marble blocks. We've got all kinds of blocks. We have the best blocks. And of course, we still have plenty of chunks lying around. So it's it's great. It's good. It's fine. Uh, though we also need to smooth these floors out as well. That's a uh, pretty key ingredient to our success, I should think. Oh, I'm hearing, I'm hearing bad sounding things going on out there. I should smooth this room as well, just so it's not completely hideous. What's going on out here? Alright. Life is still good. You know, to be honest, maybe what I should do... Like, I'm... I mean, we've never had a raid from this corner before, so I could probably safely wall this up. Actually, to be honest, if I set things up right... I could probably design... Actually, has anyone even come through this side before? I think the answer is no. But yeah, maybe I'll wall this off and I'll put like a gate on it so, you know, you could theoretically leave this way and then we'll like fence the rest in. And this could be our... Um, yeah, that could be our, our place for our animals. 
Wait, this was made out of marble. It's also made out of marble. Why is this one? Seeing this one is like looking darker than than the other, the other wall we've got here. But I could just be imagining that. Oh, okay. I look at this and I think to myself, yeah, this this is not the right floor for me. Just, it just doesn't have the look. I think we're either going to have to look for even more flooring mods. Or we are going to have to... I mean, I suppose the uh, checkered stuff could work. I mean, slate and marble actually looks like it would be the best. Have that nice black and white kind of thing going there. Hmm. How's it looking in here so far, anyway? Extremely impressive, rich, extremely spacious, beautiful, and clean. And to be honest, kind of got an idea here. Damn, if only the marriage spot was like three squares wide. Because then it would like perfectly fit in front of this. That would be cool. Suppose we could also, we could start the cult stuff if we really want it. Wait, we don't have a grimoire of the occult. No one ever got that, and yet it says I can build it. Curious, but all right. All right, now we can finally make some beer. The most important, the most important thing, really. I should do stuff with this as well. Anyway, uh, yeah, so brewing, brewerizing. Let's go under production, which is, as I recall, there we go. Aha, the mead barrel. And also regular fermenting barrel for regular beer. But yes, Dwarven Mead. Alright, we obviously need a couple of these in here. Alright, it also occurs to me this floor is not perfectly smooth, so we'll probably... I, well, I, you know what, I don't want to put too much effort into that, because I'm pretty sure most of our smiths... Oh, wait, actually, nope. I was going to say most of our smiths might do that over, you know, like the work we would rather them do. Uh, of course, we also, we need to grow Mead, don't we? Uh... Hello there, corpse. How long have you been lying there? Where's earth bread? I mean, I assume it's for bread and not for, you know, other stuff. Uh, well, I guess while we're at it, let's uh, have a peek. Uh, what do we need? Honey root? Is that uh, scarred by dwarves? This plant produces a sweet preserving agent similar to honey from a beehive. It only survives underground and dies when exposed to light. Okay. So that means I'm going to need to, like, get, uh, terrain here cannot support this. Oh, is that because it's been smoothed out? That's probably it. No, that's not it. Wait, what does tilled soil, soil require? Soil, obviously. That's, that's what it needs. So we need to, like, terraform and soil from, let's see, rocky dirt from soil, from gravel, from... From rock. Wait, actually, that's a good question. How do I grow this? How do I grow this stuff? Let's let's have a look here. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh yeah, we also need a brewery, I guess. There we go. There's our pemmican. I thought we were making cram. Or is there some weird thing going on where we're like producing cram anyway? Hey, hey, don't just, don't just quit the job, dog. All right, well, I mean, if that's, uh, that's how it's going to be. Oh, yeah, I guess we need a new research project in order to keep people busy. Let's research some basic farming. That way we can get some useful farmy, stuffy things going, which is always good. Got a few more floors to piece in here. Yeah, I really don't like the look of this. To be honest, I'm almost thinking maybe this would have looked better if I did the opposite. Had this for, like, the sides, and then just this for, like, the, the front walkie path thing. Or, I mean, I suppose even better would be if I, I don't know, like, had this as, like, the, like, the border. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not terribly great at interior design, to be honest. I mean, back in the olden days when I used to play The Sims, I mean, I, I had stuff that, I, you know, was good enough, as far as I was concerned. 
But, uh, yeah. I was never terribly, terribly, uh, good at making great looking uh, houses and such. But I always try. I mean, may not have, uh, may not have the skill for it all that, you know, or, yeah, well, yeah. I may not have particularly great skills whatsoever, but, uh, I try and that's what matters. Probably, mostly, usually, sometimes. Anyway, overall, I'm happy. I like, I like what we've got. We, uh, uh, why are you, uh, you have a bed, right? Yes. Though it occurs to me if we recruit this other dude who's, you know, just duding it up over here, then we are, oh, seriously, you're gonna, you're gonna eat it over there and then whine about eating without a table? Or did you actually eat it? God damn it, there's a table right here, you dingus. Some people. Anyway, it also occurs to me it's probably time to wrap this episode up. There's gold in these walls that we can probably do gold-related things with. And, yeah, so when we come back... Uh, how are we actually making out with this? I mean, we've still got some dwarven armor to make. We've got a king's crown to make, which Cat is apparently working on, which is cool. We've got some dwarven horn bows we want to make, so... All right. Oh, in fact, there's a, there's a horn bow right there. So, yeah, anyway, let's just wrap this up before I keep, uh, keep rambling on any longer. So, yeah, as always, thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to hit that like button or maybe leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you're thinking, and I will see all you in the next video.